lose someone's marbles means someone lost the cool. Perhaps marbles meant mind or wits before lose someone's marble was coined. The notion of losing something that is important to you appears to have migrated from the image of a forlorn child having lost his prized playthings. An early citation of this figurative usage is found in an August 1886 copy of the St. Louis Globe Democrat. He has roamed the block all morning like a boy who had lost his marbles. I can help to think about a news that was reported in Daily Mail. The young children has been running up gambling debts, playing games of marbles in the street, with some resorting to stealing to pay them off. Groups of up to 40 youngsters, aged as young as five, are playing the game called Pids, which involves flicking the marble into an open water metric cover in the street surface. Police in Devon, England, said parents have complained that some children are resorting to stealing cash, DVDs, and computer games to pay off debts incurred by playing for money. Historically, this game would involve winning each other's marbles, but it has come to our attention more and more children are playing each other for money. Police and housing association staff are now going door to door in the area to talk to parents about the problem. Letters has also been sent to parents by the nearby school. All gambling is addicting. Imagine being addicted as a child and not being aware of it until later in life. Nowadays, a lot of children have access to the internet at a young age, and their parents don't realize that they are exposed to hundreds and thousands of gambling ads on the internet. I created six signs to spread gambling awareness. The first four signs are inspired by the characters in Playing Cards, which is the number one gambling game among children in China. The first two includes a lightning in the heart, which shows gambling is dangerous. The third sign shows a child is trapped in a black diamond, representing gambling's effect on mental health. And the fourth sign shows that gambling is evil. The fifth sign shows a child is present in the form of a dice, which means that you can be addicted to gambling and it will limit your future and the space for children to grow. A loot box is a consumable virtual item which can be redeemed to receive a randomized selection of further virtual items. It was popularized through their inclusion in several games throughout the mid 2010s. By the later half of the decade, some games expanded approaches to the concept that caused them to be highly criticized. Such criticism include play-to-win gameplay system that favor those that spend real money on the loot boxes, and negative effects on gameplay system to accommodate. A lot of parents who don't know anything about games might be wondering where did all the money that they gave their kids went. This sign draws attention to the gameplay system for parents. I designed playing cards that contains my signs, and it can also act alone as a poster to spread the awareness and the seriousness of child gambling problems. I wish my signs can make more people be aware of the danger of exposing children to gambling and make a difference in the fight against gambling addiction.